The following Meat Fest was brought to you by SleekStudios.com. Stay classy, Internet. Hi, guys. This is Ood Gamer with Sleek Studios. And I'm about to take you through the hospital. Or at least part of it. Super Meat Boy! <laughs> yeah, this is part two. Now... Big dramatic opening. Let's see what we can do here. Doesn't seem to be this difficult. Uh, doesn't seem to be that difficult yet. Oh. Yep. Oh, I spoke too soon. All right. For those of you. Oh shit. All right. So I do have a little game if you guys want to play it. It's called Let's See Who Can Get Alcohol Poisoning. Oh shit. Now, the way to play the game is, originally I was going to do every time I died, but obviously you are going to get severely hurt yourself if you were to try that. If you really want to, go ahead. Uh, advised for frat parties, but not too much else. Um, but if you want to, every time I swear, I'm relatively mild when I... Uh, when I game on mic, so it shouldn't be too bad. But if you were keeping track, you're already about uh, four drinks or four sips in at least. So I think that's a nice little game to play. And Bandage Girl is saved. Level one down. Yep. Now my big question here is, why the needles? No, probably a better question. Why are they falling? Or are they being shot upwards? Not quite sure on this one. Right. Oh, shit. Now as, uh, as Sleek did say in the in the first video, there was a little bit of an issue with PETA, actually, with uh, with Super Meat Boy. They kept thinking he was made of meat, and if you thought that, I, I do apologize, I've broken your little bubble. Uh, he's just a boy with no skin. Which, you know, it's kind of sad. Boy with no skin, trying to, trying to meet up with his girlfriend, covered in bandages. I actually think they were in a severely, severe, uh, car crash, actually, and unfortunately they're just trying to be reunited, and so the evil fetus is, well, fed up? I don't know. Maybe it's a social commentary about, uh, about abortion. Or, maybe it's just a fun game and I'm overthinking it. But yes, the... The issue with PETA. Um, well, they made their own game, Super Tofu Boy. And if you really want to, you can actually use him as a playable character in Super Meat Boy. Uh, you put in the code PETA file, and you actually get, uh, get to play as Super Tofu Boy. Which, I haven't quite tried it myself, I should probably get on that. And, uh... But I have heard that his stats are actually worse than Super Meat Boy's. He's, uh, he's not a great character to play as. <laughs> but if you want to support PETA while well, playing as a boy with no skin, we here at Sleek Studios support your decision. Uh, personally, I'm I'm a fan of PETA. I'm a fan of the idea. Uh, you know, no cruelty to animals, all of that. But Sometimes the way you go about it's a little, uh, a little obscure, you know? Alright, please don't beat your animals, and now we're going to show you a naked woman holding a pet. Because we paid her a lot of money to do so, not because she actually supports our ideals. Uh, maybe I've got their whole game plan wrong. I could be wrong, but, uh, don't think so. Oh, well, I guess I've forgotten about the drinking game. I've just been rambling on here. And 
dying an extensive amount. Uh, anybody who has been playing with deaths, I'm so sorry. You should probably have 911 on standby. Uh, anybody playing by me swearing, as I've said, I'm relatively mild. But uh, you can go fuck yourself, if that makes you feel any better. Son of a bitch. Okay. As you can see, this has been a real pain in my ass. And uh, you have seen that we've already completed a few of these levels. Uh, let's consider those the uh, <laughs> the outtakes. They didn't quite make it, uh, make it, but the sad thing is I did, uh, I did surprisingly well going through this the first time I tried, and then after the first time it, everything falls to shit. It was the, uh, the next couple of levels that really got difficult, and of course, now I can't even do the simple ones, which is falling and not being pricked by a needle. Or multiple needles in this case. Well, good news, I've successfully painted the walls. Bad news uh, wasn't the point of the game. An extreme meat painter. Or Super Meat Boy Painter Edition. Probably like Super Mario Paint, only interesting. Now, I'm probably going to get flack on that from Sleek. He's a fan of the retro games, and I think he has a bit of a bro crush on Mario. He's always had a thing for the Italians. Oh dear, shit, I made it. Alright. So, go on this one, obviously. Don't touch anything. Um, the roof can kill you. If you stay on the floor too long, that'll kill you. If you stay on a wall too long, it'll kill you. Good times. But a hell of a lot simpler than the last one, that's for damn sure. Alright. Uh... In most games, when you see a giant fan, you think, oh, awesome. Uh, in Super Meat Boy, when you see a giant fan, you go, oh, shit. Because things are going to get difficult, and eventually I'm going to go against the wind stream and be chopped into itty-bitty meat pieces. Actually, one of my favorite, uh, favorite features of this game, I'll probably show it to you guys this time, because it won't be too intense. But... Multiple deaths! Look at all the little meat boys go! Oh, he got chopped up. The other guy fell down, and he's going down too. But number four, you made it, and we thank you. Now, this one is fun. Surprisingly large level, actually. Uh, you get to fly all over the goddamn place. And, of course, <laughs> as many things in Super Meat Boy... There's a massive open space. Do not touch it. Because obviously it's not going to end well for you. Uh, as Sleek has said, I am a little bit of a completionist, so I am going to try to get the man bandages at least. Uh, oh, damn it. Almost made it, too. That's the, that's the pain in the ass. When it comes to... Uh, when it comes to Super Meat Boy, you know, you almost... You want to say no. You want to say no to being a completionist because, especially where we're making the videos, it would severely help on time. But, uh, I don't know. There's something in me that's just, I can't do it. I, if I think I can do it, if I, especially if I've done it before, I'm, oh shit. Uh, I'm going to take the time and I'm going to try my damnedest to uh, to get what I can get. Oh, uh, shit. Hey, I made it. Alright. Oh, no, you don't. You jump your little meat ass back up there. Alright, how about this? Compromise. Whew, that almost worked. 
Alright. You know what, guys? I may... I may have to do... A compilation video of, uh... Of restarting the game and just getting the, uh... Getting the bandages. Which, I know, not nearly as fun, but... At least it'll be here. Uh... Yeah, for those of you who didn't know, there's two ways to actually beat this level. Uh, one is the hard way, which involves all those fans. The other way is the way I just took, which is the cheap little road down. Come on, you saucy little piece. I know, that one was weird. Saucy little piece, and I didn't swear at all. Sorry, fuckers. Oh, shit. See, I'm trying to make the drinking game e interesting for you guys, but, uh... I'm also a little sympathetic. Because I know there's a few of you watching that obviously shouldn't be watching because you probably aren't the legal age to drink in your com country. But, uh... You love gaming and, uh... Love difficult games, and that's why you're here. To watch people get absolutely frustrated with, uh, difficult games. Oh, right, these guys. Love these guys. Little blood clots. My family. Oh, shit. But the biggest issue with the blood clots, I find, other than the fact that if you touch them, you die, uh, is that they're, they're happy. They're ridiculously happy. They're happy fucking blood clots. Which probably wouldn't be that big of an issue, but, again, it, it feels to me like they're family, and I don't know about your family. Mine drives me absolutely insane. Uh, but it's kind of like a family reunion whenever you meet up with the... Uh, <laughs> whenever you meet up with the blood clots, it's... Hate to see you go, but... No. Love to see you go. Get the fuck out of my house. But... <laughs> oh. There we go. I'm just going to give this level one shot. Alright, one more shot. And, uh, if I don't do it, I'm going to actually pass this one off to Sleek. Alright. Killed by Blood Clot. Have a good one, guys. This is, uh, Ood Gamer with Sleek Studios again. Don't forget to check us out on Facebook, slash Sleek Studios. Uh, at SleekStudios.com, obviously. And on Twitter, at Sleek Reno. Alright, guys, have a good one, and... I hope uh, Sleek actually keeps up with the drinking game, because I don't know about you guys, I think it's kind of fun. Alright, have a good one, guys.